Hello guys, welcome back to Ventilate. And guys, I have an interesting... Oh, why did I do that? See, this is what happens when you get a bit too consistent in what you're doing, you're not thinking, and I prestige by accident there because I was about to jump into the tournament showing you guys where I'm at. We have about 11 hours and 50 minutes to go, so we have a little bit of time. Not too much time, but just enough time for us to be able to play this uh, tournament. Hopefully, it's past that 12 hour mark, which means I am hopefully not joining 20 hours into, sorry, three or four hours into a tournament that I'm joining a fresh new tournament because it's 12 hours plus. So, one way to find out. I'm very sorry, guys, you have to wait a little bit because I need to get back up to my prestige level. And once I get back up to my prestige level, then we should be sweet to go. Oh, look at that contract hit. Once the contract hits, guys, it is a doozy. It just goes absolutely quickly all the way back up, all the way back up to where I need to be. As you can tell, the speed is faster, the hits are stronger, the skips are faster. So contracts, 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 guys. If there is a way you can max out your contract, um, it really helps a lot. Um, maybe that's a wrong matter, but for me, I like it and I love it and I will max it out because I feel like it's a lot more beneficial for me. So here we are. We should be very, very close to it. Um, I think it's 3,350, I think. Sorry, is it? Yeah, 300,033, sorry, 333,500. I think that is where we are. I think we need to get back up to that and then I think we're sweet to go. Uh, let me quickly check. I think it might be a bit higher. Are we back up to it? Uh, is there any more to it? Yep, we've got one more to go. What, what, what's the thing? I have to get back up to it. Yep, okay. Oh, 334,500. Okay, so 334,500 before we can get back up to that stage. And then we should be able to prestige again. Okay, we're not too far away. Um, we just need a little bit more of a push. There we go. There we go. We're almost there. Come on, my friend. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yep, okay. Let me join the tournament. So at least you guys got to see, it's about two minutes and 18 seconds per run. Uh, it used to be just under a minute and 30 with a clan ship built. However, they did change the meta. You can't even do that. Even if you can do that, it, it won't let you prestige. You say it would be an error or something because they, they don't want people cheating. Um, I'm not really sure how that consists of cheating, but hey, uh, it is what it is, right? They put on the uh, cap thing so that you can't level up too quickly. Uh, am I upset about it? Nope. It is what it is, guys. Uh, the only time it's going to be absolutely crucial is when they have a 99 prestige per day. That's when it really changes the game. That's when I reckon they should relax it a bit, boost it up a little bit, you know, instead of just having the same old typical events that this particular event is going to be stronger on, let's say, for example, a pet build or this event is particularly stronger say for example clan ship build then or, or, or shadow clone build or whatever and you get a lot more stronger build that way that particular event everyone will be bending over backwards to try a new build and i think that could be quite interesting um is it good or not i don't know because the meta the balance it, it's it's gonna suck right so for example if you're a pet builder and you have say three times the speed instead of a clan ship build and that guy's built all his life to the clan ship build, and now he's in a pet build, and he can't he can't compete. This whole event is screwed for him. Like he's absolutely screwed. Like he's just fucked. Like there's nothing he can do about it. Um, so I think there is a bit of an unfairness to it. Um, I don't know. Maybe like a week long tournament could be interesting. I I have no idea. But I do really enjoy the whole concept of just max prestiging. I think that is just so so fun. Like it's. It's like 99 prestige is just so fun. It just gives you a lot more variety so that people can't just, hey, let me just buy. Say for example, the event was like, say, three weeks. If you prestige 99 every day, you're guaranteed to win, 100%, right? And the guys that are buying the chest at the end of it have to spend a significant more amount. In fact, it is not even possible unless you have a lot of money. And even if you have a lot of money, I don't think you're gonna be able to get the win if someone else is prestiging 99 times a day right and so i i feel like that's a bit better because it, it's not like a pay to play to win kind of situation not that to say it is right now because there is a way around it and you can you know win and, and get in the top 10 percent so yeah i feel like you you need to get up to a point where 
there is a, a maximum crazy amount of like prestigious and then the awards should be a whole lot bigger uh, because it's like a meritocracy right the harder you work uh the more you get uh, the more you should win and i think that could be a very very good point instead of just fighting for that 10 percent so imagine everyone's already going hard on that 10 percent imagine how much more they would go hard for something that would be a lot more worthwhile say 100 skill points or whatever and and then so forth and yada 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 i think that could be something very interesting that would put a spanner into the whole game and it really really changed the game up and people would be a lot more uh competitive in that situation so that's what I think, but hey, I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you guys think you should do something interesting? I mean, I bet you there'll be a whole lot of ideas that we can put out there. And guys, to be very honest with you, because Tap Titans 2 is a little bit quieter, or actually a lot more quieter than back then uh, on Reddit. So if you do put any suggestions out, they actually would take it seriously because they don't have to sift through, say, a thousand comments. They're, they're literally going through maybe a hundred comments a week instead of a thousand comments. And that's going to really, really help them um, improve the game or even give them ideas on how to make the game better and if it ever comes into fruition that works well for them and their business plan guess what they'll probably implement it because if it works for them and if it makes them more money if it makes them more profit for doing this and it makes the game more interesting brings in more traffic it is almost like brainless for them not to do it right and so at the end of the day if the incentive is great for them i think it would be amazing so Feel free to continue to put suggestions in Tap Titans 2 and I think now is probably the best time because not a lot of people are talking on it. Uh, you're going to get a bit more attention and that way uh, you can probably contribute to something amazing and uh, an idea could really take off. Uh, so we'll see how it goes and the game is always changing, they're, they're always developing, they're, they always have all these things in the pipelines and as we speak right now, even though we just got the new raid situation, they definitely have a whole bunch of things in the pipeline ready to go that is not even announced to the public just yet. Um, these guys are very very proactive and I really do enjoy it. This is the only game that can keep me playing for years on a mobile which is absolutely insane, right? Years. Most games you play one week, two weeks, and you're probably bored and you quit it. Uh, if you play maybe a month or two, then you're done. Maximum a year and you go, hey, nothing's changed. It's the same old, you know, this and that. I'm done. I'm not playing this game anymore. And that's very, very common, right? With this game, you can go a whole lot further. All right, guys. So let me quickly show you my situation here. So I haven't even checked the leaderboard. So hopefully the leaderboard is not too crazy. Yep, two hours in. Okay, I should be able to back the W unless someone else comes in. But... However, we are going to do all our summonings. Okay, quick summon. Let's get it all out of the way. Bang, bang, bang. Chicka, chicka, wow, wow. Let's go. And we've got five more to go. One, two, three, four, five. Done skis. Okay. And there you guys go. Look at that. Look at the amount of increase. That is just insane. Absolute insanity. Okay. Two, two. Can we do this one? Okay, can we up that? No, oh, no. So we still have to up this before we can go up there. Okay, cool. Sounds fair to me. Sounds fair to me. Or else I think everyone will <laughs> just be skipping that uh, Chesterson. They don't care about Chesterson, you know? Who cares about Chester? Chester. Chester. Chester can screw it, mate. Chester. Um, all right, and that should give us a bit of a boost. And then uh, how much is there to go? Uh, okay, I'll probably just go 25 each of these. Let me get up to 25, 25, so about 14. Come on, at least 14, okay. And then we're gonna go five on each of them. Um, that should be able to give it a bit of a doozy of a push from the bottom. And then we'll see how we go on the top here. I think the mana is slowly running out fast as we're not hitting as quickly. And I might have to wait for the next contract. So guys, when it comes to this situation, obviously I'm trying to make a video, so it's going to be a little bit slower than I would be if I was just playing uh, by myself. But yeah, so now I have to wait for the contracts to come back in order for me to get the damage that I need. And I don't think there'll be any new items that's going to help us anyway. We're way, 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 way ahead. So just got to get rid of that. And we should have a bit more uh, diamonds. Oh, wow, we're still pushing, even though we're not even man that is crazy so that is crazy uh we should be able to get a whole lot higher and let's see how much higher we can get to so the next one is 7500 so yep we're already there let's collect this bad boys get a few more stuff in should be able to get a few of the um what do you call that um skill points and get some skill let's go activate the spells 
and we are sweet mate i don't think the contract's back up yet is it is it back up no oh yeah it is a, it, uh, i think the spells are back up look i really wish that they had like an indication whether the spells are on or off <laughs> that, that would be really really helpful um however maybe i'm asking too much but hey a little indication that would be nice um that would give me a bit of a, a heads up on where we are um, that would be cool but yeah so at the, at the start of it um what i mean by the start of it so once you get past daemon of the darkness you're gonna see a significant amount of heroes that you can upgrade it's almost like you starting all over again and so the, the amount of upgrades is crazy uh you you should think and figure out if it's worthwhile using some of your uh, boosters because with some of these boosters uh, you're going to be able to help oh sorry perks you're going to be able to help push that a lot faster without you actually clicking them and that way you ha can spend a lot more time on the in game rather than just try and upgrade and just smack it all out with a whole bunch of um, um, uh, prestigious and then that way you can get back up to the top okay let me swap it out to my Sophia's Faith that should give me a few more extra levels to push. I'm pretty sure. Yep, there we go. There we go, there we go. Guys, this is going to be a bit of a long video because I still have to show you my raids, uh, as I promised, because our clan has just got back into the raiding situation. Uh, we, we, we absolutely smashed it and unlocked the next 14 raids. So we should be back up to the top now. Okay, it seems to slow down now. It's not much point. Like it is where it is now. And, and that's that's going to be about it. Okay, sweet. All right, let me just quickly show you. We have arrived. Bang, bang, bang. We're still in our first ones. Okay, we are always going to get rid of the cursed armor first. So that is the first thing we need to do. So let me get rid of this bad boy here. Look at that, we only just <laughs> we only just arrived or whatever and look at that, we are already smashing it out. This is absolute insanity. I love it, I love it, I love it. Hopefully you guys are having just as much fun in your clans because you are probably doing the most damage if your clan isn't active. And for those that your clans are very active, you are definitely absolutely smashing it. Guys, I would recommend now is probably the better time than ever before that higher clans are actually uh, allowing more people to join their uh, clans even though they're a lot smaller and does not have that much um, experience uh, the reason why they're doing that is so that they can help boost the actual amount of hits because if you're active you should be able to get into the top 100 clans all right it should be an easy easy entry into the top 100 clans if you can get into it i say get into it because it will help you grow a significant amount and it's going to help a lot in the long run for you so don't don't stay too too much in in you know clans unless you really do enjoy their company everyone's very active then 100 the whole point of the clan is that as long as everyone is active even if you're not in the top 100 clans that's fine but if your clan is not active it is probably time to think about yourself a little bit and start moving on because if they're not active, there's really not much you can do. Like, literally, not much you can do. Um, all right, so there we go. We're doing pretty good here. We should be able to do, so that was like 80, 70 mil. So let's hope we can do a few more million here. Oh, look at that cursed almond just taking that hit. Oh, absolutely getting smack and destroyed. Oh, look at that. Nice, nice. So I reckon this should be another 70 mil hit, I would say probably just under 70 mil uh if we're lucky we'll probably get about 75 but i would say it's a 70 mil what do you guys bet what do you guys bet 60 50 what do you think yeah that's right let's see who's right and wrong yep 70 <laughs> not too bad of a guess i say i say that's pretty good solid solid guess um chess maybe we'll go with this first okay we should get rid of some of the legs here okay the legs lovely lady legs i should be able to actually get rid of this cursed armor yeah let me try that because if we can get rid of the cursed armor we're going to be able to do a whole lot more damage on all the other hits from now on so maybe i should be a bit selfish here let me get this out of the way uh, we should be able to finish this ourselves yeah easy 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 peasy easy there we go beautiful absolutely amazing still doing about 350,000 oh that passive is just insane okay sweet so that's four two more to go definitely going to do it on the chest so let me get a bit of a burst on the chest over here um, 
there we go 1.2 oh 2 million oh that is lovely oh don't you love it guys look at that 2 million wow amazing i am speechless guys i've probably seen it 1.3 1.4 some of them 1.5 boosting 1.7 but 2 million that is amazing absolutely stunning okay 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 all right so that does another 75 mil so let me see if i can do one more what should i use next what should we use next uh, ba, 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 ba. okay maybe this could be good and we're gonna probably need a bus probably this would be a good bus and this should be a good yeah that should be sweet and let me do the arms this should be able to do quite a significant amount of damage let's see how much are we doing oh wait oh that's already destroyed oh crap amazing i didn't even realize that was already done ah uh, yeah so that is pretty solid so 270 plus 198 um i reckon this should be about a 60 million i would say probably 60 mil yeah i reckon a solid 60 mil for this and we should be able to get rid of this armor as well guys you do want to get rid of armor before you start hitting other parts because that is just significant amount of damage is going to help Ooh, just under 50 mil because i thought the other armor was not done yet okay so there you guys go 424 million damage out of order six so someone's already doing 600 wait for some of the bigger boys to come in they they're going to be hitting one point something 1 1.2 1 1.3 billion <laughs> this is absolute insanity um yeah all right guys that's it for me um i'm gonna keep farming this uh you guys know how it works i already showed you how i'm doing it so now you guys can use this tactic to get into tournaments smack it out hit it strong hit it home all right guys thank you very much and i hope you all had a great weekend this weekend make sure you had a bit of time to to your families and your friends have a bit of a barbecue have a little bit of uh uh, meat and sausages and this and that enjoy a little bit of a beer or champagne or a wine or whatever you guys are doing make sure you do enjoy your time with your family okay enjoy the weekend and drop a like drop a subscribe and i will catch you tomorrow on monday at the end of this tournament bye bye